Well, welcome back, everyone, to my soon-to-be-famous Lego Harry Potter Years 1 through 4 walkthrough on Wii, or console, whatever. Uh, I hate that little ball of light machine. It just disturbs me. Well, if you remember, we left off in front of our charms classroom with Professor Flitwick about to learn our first spell. And what do you think the spell is? What spell will we be learning in part three? Things are flying, Ron's mad at Hermione. Can you tell? I don't know. Oh, well, they didn't. <laughs> no, this is a door. I don't expect you to answer me. Oh, Ron. Wow, Ron. Honestly, honestly, just ridiculous. Well, it's Wingardium Leviosa. And. This spell is very important in this game. It's the most commonly used spell. Uh, just like in the other games, too. In some of the other games, when Guardian Livio said it is quite important. Not as important as, like, in the other games, it's Flipendo. I know that's important, but this is most important. Apart from this spell that you just... The random firing spell, which actually might be Flipendo. I don't know. But, uh... So we use Wingardium Leviosa, hold Z to cast Wingardium Leviosa. And we've already saved Ron, one of the people that Ron has terrorized. Yay! Alright, so again, my stud count might be a little different from when we last left off because I had to go back to the common room because I didn't do anything that saved between then and now. Because I stopped playing the game. I can't record it all at once and split it up in the parts because I'm terrible at editing and I don't have any of that recording software stuff, but basically, I'm just trying to get this done for you guys in the best way I can, and as you see, you you guys can do walkthroughs too, you don't need to have all of that special recording stuff, it looks better that way, but it doesn't mean a better quality walkthrough, you could, it could, you could have all that stuff and be a terrible person to video game, and that, that would really suck, you don't want to watch a walkthrough by someone who can't play the game. So anyway, these things are, I don't know what they're called, in the instruction, if you look in your instruction book, they're called spellets or something, and what they do is you basically, they're all around Hogwarts and in levels, and you put them together, and they can do something for you. And these I'm trying to get up here, I don't know if I'll be able to. Okay. There we go. Alright. We want to get as many stuff as we can. It's not in level so that we mess up and we get true wizards because we don't want to do that yet. But you can in story mode. You always can if you want. Alright. I'm just going to do this the right way to show you how to do it. And I sincerely hope that my camera doesn't cut off in the middle of the level. That's what it did the first time. And, okay. So this part may be a bit short if I only do this class. So I might do the next class. Which is... Oh, you'll have to find out. So anyway, so we come up here, we save one of the people, we shoot this orange painting like Dumbledore told us to do. The last part, make this. And we can, so basically it's just all these pulley system things. And we have to fix them, we have to get these weird little hands to hold them. Anyway. Oh wait, no, we won't do that yet. <laughs> That's something for, uh... You know, we can, and it's not anything very really important. Yeah. It takes a long time, too. You, know, you, get, you get a character token, you think it's worth it, and it's just, boy! Boy, not even just, oh my god, it's a worthless character. But at least it's, he's a wizard. If you play him, if you get him, you'll find out he's a wizard. But okay, again, let's do this quickly, so on my camera. That's enough on me. I'm gonna need a new camera soon, so this doesn't happen. And so it's gonna be better quality. Because I know, like I said, it doesn't have to be great quality to be a good walkthrough, but I want it to be the best quality it can be for you guys. And this one, the night goes spear, and we save the students. 
Wingardium Leviosa. Wingardium. Wingardium Leviosa. Not Leviosa. Jeez, people. Anyway, okay, so we've done that, and... How long is this video? Six minutes? Okay. I hope we can go to the next class without screwing anything up. Oh, wait, no. The next thing is not a class. It's... A level. Okay, that's right. So, we probably won't be able to do that without screwing anything up. But, um... That level... Ish, but I don't know. I don't, don't want to risk it. I don't want to risk wasting a part. So, we're gonna make our way toward the level. If you, if you play the game already, or if you know the movie, you know what happens after Wingardium Leviosa. After we learn Wingardium Leviosa. Or what day it is, I should say. Can I do this fast? This part's gonna be really short. Okay. Alright, so we've opened that up. Put this on there, it does absolutely nothing with us, does basically just teaching us how to use Lombardi Mobile, so Yes, the hang of things. That's nothing either. But this is a really big area. This is like the entrance hall or something. Those things you see right there that are glowing, those are just a different time. They, we can't access those until year two either. Um, I suppose we can click around here. We still got a bunch of time. I'm going to end it soon. I don't trust my camera. The war will break out around 10 minutes. So we've got... I'll stop it around 9 minutes or something. Oh, wait. Can we can rebuild these. Oh, we have a little bit of video. So. Alright. We'll only do that. Like I said, I don't trust this camera. So here's something we will do. Not that. We gotta back up to do this. The target. No! Target this red banner. And that green banner. And you get a student in peril, I think, and a gold brick. So, yay! Okay, yeah. Alright, so, we can build this now. And, over there, I think I will leave it right there. Because I really do not trust my camera. I keep telling you that. But, come back next time. And we should do the next level, which I have to tell you, the Mountain Troll on Halloween. Ooh, see ya.